it's uh, we'll paint a pound and just go up here to the Brackener Gorge Further to Bunyaroo Gorge. Pretty misty, no rain, but lots of dust, lots of flies. This is by Teamsters Campground and the vertical burrowing nesting areas. I would have thought it would have been the only birds that could get up there. And again, get all sorts. I thought we were getting rid of these goats in the uh, Flinders Ranges. There's one there. There's a baby one over there. Or a youngster, not a baby. And Mama Bear was just back over behind us. So yeah, they're still around. Come on you Rangers. Get in there and get rid of them. What would they eat in a day? And what would they wreck in a day? And gee, they're worth good money at the uh, butchers. Hey, Billy. <laughs> Look at him go. They got nothing left to eat. The goats have eaten it all. And there we go. There's a little flock of sheep. We're trying to protect the area for the rock uh, wallabies. And uh, yeah, you got all these feral goats and sheep in here. They're obviously not feral sheep, but you think they'd be keeping them out as well in a national park. Okay, this is part of the Razorback View lookout and yeah, beautiful sweeping views. There's the viewing area and there's the view, clear of trees other than a few. And people have actually made their own little track and come up here to take some uninterrupted photos and videos of the ranges. How good's that? Here we are at Razorback Lookout. I was just down at the lower Razorback Lookout, covered in trees. But as you can see, there's only one, one tree right there. It's pretty magnificent. Look 
uh, St Mary's Peak, that's that one in the background over there, that's the highest point of the ranges. We've just come from Rawnsley Quartz site and followed that track all the way through here. I won't read it till anything. Uh, gee, the old Adelaide Ocean. I'm sure they called it Adelaide Ocean back in the day. 650 to 550 million years ago before the ranges were formed. stop it and have a read yourselves but pretty specky surprise there's no eagles flying around Becky. St. Mary's Peak, been up there. Probably not going to do it today though. I think this is the ABC range. It's just uh, after the Wilpena Pound turn off. St. Mary's Peak up there. Haze in the afternoon. Yeah, we're not in the North uh, National Park here, but have a look at them goats all up there, half up the hill. Probably hard to see without being able to zoom in, but they're just below that rock face and they're over there on the right too. No wonder there's no rock wallabies. They've got nothing to eat because the goats have eaten it all. Load the dump truck. I reckon this will be uh, you, Mitch, in a few years' time. With your four kids running amok <laughs> all over the countryside, down at Cape Jaffa. Get the drone up on them. There's another one back at camp, but I don't think they can actually uh, be bothered joining this crew. These, these guys just don't stop. All good fun. They're having a good time, that's what it's all about. Yep, load up the truck with the rocks. Yeah. Hey, while you're there, can you pick some firewood up for me? Not a phone or an iPad amongst any of them. Just having good old fun playing in the dirt with rocks and a toy truck that he got for his birthday. Oh, it's his birthday, so now we're going to have a party as well. Oh, beautiful. See what you got to look forward to, Lucinda? 
lots of little Mitchells running around. Turning eight, you beauty. Yeah, let's go. Days up in the ranges, everything's sweet. The kids up there had their Easter egg hunt, their birthday party yesterday, and scared every living animal away for about 30 kilometers. But they had fun what it's all about and these nerds over here they had fun too where's he going have a shit no he didn't go up there to have a shit he went up there chasing a goat <laughs> he's halfway up that hill And he's got no hope of catching a mountain goat up there. Oh, and the dog's up there as well. The dog chased the goat up there. He's trying to get his dog back. <laughs> uh, uh, well, you shouldn't bring a sheep dog out here, should you, mate? They like herding things up. <laughs> it's gone halfway up the hill. Oh, look how high he is. He's up by that tree. <laughs> now he's got to get his dog down. Oh, there's two of them up there. Two blokes trying to chase their, their dog. There's kangaroo poo up there, which means there's uh, rock wallabies up there. And they ain't going anywhere near the place. With the dog around. 